The following is a video podcast from the Wessels Living History Farm. There's a lot of folklore about the weather, and uh, I made this poem out of um, snatches of folklore that I've picked up over the years. How to foretell a change in the weather. Rain always follows the cattle sniffing the air and huddling in fields with their heads to the lee. You will know that the weather is changing when your sheep leave the pasture too slowly and your dogs lie about and look tired, when the cat turns her back to the fire washing her face and the pigs wallow in litters. Cocks will be crowing at unusual hours, flapping their wings. Hens will chant. When your ducks and your geese are too noisy and the pigeons are washing themselves, when the peacocks squall loudly from the tops of the trees, when the guinea fowl grates, when sparrows chip loudly and fuss in the roadway, and when swallows fly low, skimming the earth, when the carrion crow croaks to himself and wild fowl dip and wash, and when moles throw up hills with great fervor, when toads creep out in numbers, when frogs croak, when bats enter the houses, when birds begin to seek shelter, and the robin approaches your house, when the swan flies at the wind and your bees leave the hive, when ants carry their eggs to and fro and flies bite and the earthworm is seen on the surface of things. For more, go to www.livinghistoryfarm.org.